How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to the Boogie Man. So let's see. I've got my guide in front of me, just in case. I've, which I'm gonna need at this point. And I've got me, 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 and only me. Wait, where's David? Wasn't David supposed to be with me? Hold on. Yeah, David is with me. Where is David? It's just showing me. That, okay, that's weird. Okay. Alright, I want to make sure I'm in the right area here. Where am I going anyway? It's a garden. Hello? Puppy? Puppy, are you there? Puppy? Fountain. You can see a drain in the bottom. Okay. What with? What with and why? What is this? What is this? I guess we're gonna ignore it, okay. Okay, let's uh... Okay, that was a loud scream. good that cannot be good vacation in ages. I'm sorry, Sophie. I wonder if Helena's okay. Um. Hi, Helena. Oh, it's Sophie. Is something the matter? Hi, Helena. Why did you marry Mr. Keith, Helena? Why do you ask that? Lately, I felt like my heart doesn't ever beat fast anymore. I can think people are great and all, but that's it. I can't get excited about them like I used to. It's like I forgot how to love. Oh, that's horrible. David and Shirley get along really well, so I'm jealous. And I don't want to be by myself forever. Yeah, that's understandable. So I'd like to know why you and Mr. Keith decided to get together, Helena. I, I guess that's reasonable. You know, love is like a jewel. It's buried deep in a person's heart. And one day, you just dig it up. Yeah. Feelings like love and sympathy can create all different kinds of jewels. So jealousy, anger, and pride can shatter them too. Yeah, true. Have you ever found such a jewel? Yeah, but I got rejected. Are we talking about David? Don't worry. You'll find it again. I hope you can make a wonderful jewel someday. Aw, that's sweet. Okay, that's not Sophie. So what's your jewel like, Helena? Oh no, we got they got him in reverse now. Glad I chose the voice Mine acting. Is already complete. I don't want to meddle with it anymore. I just want to keep it deep in my heart. I think that's something that needs to be fixed. Because I, I, 
I don't know. I don't know. It's like so. It says Sophie's so thing. Windy. Your hair's a mess, young lady. We should get back inside. How did I just notice this now, by the way? I'm playing as Sophie. Assuming I have to do what it shows. I doubt this goes outside. Must go somewhere else in the castle. Yeah. This is so weird. Wait. This is really weird. Where am I supposed to go? I wish this was a bit more linear than just convoluted what the hell. I mean, convoluted, I mean, not many people mind convoluted what the hell stuff, but you, you know, it's, uh, Of course I do. Wait, I just saw something on there and I was like, wait, what is that? I didn't expect that. Of all things, I did not expect that to be... That. I did not expect that to be that. That makes sense. Okay. I guess in this game it's locked shelves. There's nothing inside. Well, I unlocked them. Oh, something smells funny in here. Ugh. Boogeyman! <sighs> you were the guy from the other game, weren't you? You've been a bad girl, Sophie. Why do you want to make your father cry? Perhaps you wish to see your mother again. Boogeyman? Where's Helena? Wow! Sophie, are you mad at me? It's been so long since our last meeting. Yeah, she didn't like your last meeting, dude. What are you talking about? Don't you remember? We've met time after time in every bad dream you had as a child. Yeah, well, no one likes I'll you. I'll take you to the world inside the closet. That's so weird. I was just moving the window. But first, we need to play some more. Why don't you look after my pets? How about no? Oh. They're a bit hungry, but they're lively pups. Have fun. 
How about no? Take your time. No. Okay, that wasn't right. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. Ugh. Stop it already. Please stay away. No. Huh? Wait, what? 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 Oh gosh! <laughs> Sophie? Hi, just here playing with the puppies apparently. What happened in here? Apparently nothing. But that man locked me in here. He sick those dogs on me. I mean, it's true. Jeez. Oh, sick them? They look asleep to me. No, they were just up and attacking me. Then all of a sudden they fell asleep. Yeah, that's a little weird. It was really sudden. I mean, knowing what's going on around here, that does not surprise me. Uh, <laughs> what? Yeah, they fell asleep so quickly, as if... <coughs> Jeez? What the hell? What were you thinking? Oh, okay. Can you even imagine how much you worried your father, you idiot? I just wanted to find Helena. Don't give me excuses. I told you not to leave that room. Why don't you do what? <laughs> Keith? Stand up. Tell me you'll never do anything to make your father cry again. Say it. I have no idea what that sound was for. I'll never do it again. Keith? David, could you punch him for me? Let's go back. <sighs> Sophie! Oh, thank God. Keith, David, thank you so much. If you knew what he did to your daughter while they were out, you'd... You'd punch the living hell out of the guy. Sophie, why did you leave the room? I went to look for Helena. I was just really worried. And how worried was I when you were gone? Please, don't leave without telling me again. Mr. Keith. What? I'm sorry. Thank you for coming to find me. Keith is making me very salty right now. I apologize. Don't take your eye off that brat, Richard. Keith! She'll be the death of your daughter.
Well, no, no freaking wonder Helena isn't what it wants to t divorce that idiot. I would. Why don't you do what I tell you to? <laughs> Haven't I told you not to play in here? What if a pot or a knife fell on you? Wait, is that his son? Sorry, Dad. Aww. So, why were you playing around here? Um, I was playing policeman, and Aww. um, it's snowing today. <laughs> That's just cute. So, Keith, this mat here is white and fluffy, like snow. So, oh my gosh. Do you want to join the police, Todd? Yeah, I want to be a policeman like you, Dad. Aww. <laughs> well, well. But a policeman has to follow the rules. A boy who breaks rules can't join the force. It's the law. Okay, yeah, true. Well, unless you have connections, right? Nope. Nope. Connections? Who taught you a word like that? You did, Dad. That's no surprise. Well then, you'll join the force with your connections. That's a lame way to do it. <laughs> you probably did. Lame? Yeah, some of my buddies got in by connections, but they're all dumb, unpopular, and really lame to boot. You want to be a lame policeman, Todd? No, uh -uh. I'll be a cool policeman. But no relying on connections or playing pretend in the kitchen. Oh, come on, dude. He's a kid. Mom should be back from shopping soon. Let's go meet her. Okay. Don't want mom to run into any swindlers. Dad and I will protect her. Aww. This... Swindlers? Oh, who taught you that one? You, I'm guessing. You did that. <laughs> yeah. Right. Well, let's go. Are we taking the car? I've got a better idea. Oh, that's cute. Oops, sorry. I'm gonna guess his head hit the, the top of the door or something. <laughs> Keith, you're a prick. Keith? What's the matter? Just thinking about my son. You have a son? I'm assuming he's, he's dead. Yeah. I was gonna say I'm assuming he had rather than have. That was still an asshole thing to do. Jeez. Anyway, I actually am going to leave this video here. We'll go ahead and progress later on. Um, I gotta get away from this A hat before he pisses me off even more. I am not liking Keith at all. I haven't liked him from beginning to end of this thing. He's a dick. Anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a horror game you'd like me to do, or an RPG, let me know in the comments below. If you know one that you like, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Um, or if you want to check out one of our uh, different horror games that I've done prior to this one, it'll be across my head here. This game, however, will be in the top right-hand corner there. <clears throat> in the meantime, I'm out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye!